So in this video it's going to be about contact forms again with Bootstrap Studio. It's just going to be a small video, uh, very quick. Um, and what it is, is this is a very basic contact form. The reason um, a lot of people seem to be having is they don't really want to use the smart forms on the Bootstrap uh, developers uh, uh, studio there. So this is uh, very very basic it's your name your email a message a tick box and a send message and you know to know how these things work you have a send message there and obviously that's not going to go and you get all these send, send seems a problem with the form please correct blah blah but when it's working fine you get a message saying thank you i'll be in contact with you what you just have to do, I'm going to put the code in the description and I'm going to put the where you can find this. It's um, it's one of my sites. So I'm going to put the website in and I'm also going to do the, you know, the code for you to do that. I've also got this here, which is uh, three um, column with the, with the block here. You, as people know in, in responsive design, it's usually a 12 um block thing that we use in rows and, and and columns and that so it's uh three on the sides and six in the middle so everything's central and of course there is websites that you do and what a, a contact form perhaps is on the right hand side but this is just very basics there's no menus there's nothing like that so what to do on this is i've um if you just go keep the assets so just export and if you're interested in looking at the form I've done just you keep the assets but you have to change the index or whichever name you want to do yours uh, for example if you're doing a one-page site it's got to be if you're going to use forms it's got to be index.php um, of course there's there's other things that's coming now with uh, back and back in development which is no js and stuff like that but i know php so yeah you just change that so for so when you put it up on site and i'll just show you how that works is this is like boot bootstrap test slash form dot php so that's if you just had it in html it ain't going to work so that's all i want you to of course you can put whatever colors you want and it's just um so just to simplify the whole process the other things that you've got to, when you see the uh, code is when it's an email the email on on my uh, code will go to me you've got to change the email to wherever you go you know your email address obviously it would be no good to come to me so just uh I'm just pointing that out for you. Okay, so um, yeah, once again, as there's a, I've got a lot of emails, pla um, emails. <laughs> I've got a lot of uh, videos planned, but I've, I'm on with uh, three sites at the moment, so um, it's just trying to get time. So again, thanks for watching these videos.